What up Wastelanders? Thanks again for joining me for another Gaslands NorCal conversion video. This time I'm going to be doing two monster truck builds. I'm going to be using a Matchbox uh, Raptor and I am also going to be using this uh, Hot Wheels 87 Dodge D100. So um, doing both these at the same time so we'll see how this goes. For the wheels I'm going to be using these wheels that I got from Dice Mechanic Games. I love how chunky these are. Um, I'm going to be try using a tractor tire and these other big old chunky tires, so we'll see how it goes. Now, as you can see, just having them on here, those aren't going to fit, so I'm going to have to uh, make my own uh, axles, so I'll be grinding those down, and this is a uh, tube from the doggy bag, the bags that you use to pick up after your dog's taking for a walk, so I'm going to be cutting this in half and see if I can get that uh, to work for that Raptor. Uh, for this one, I've got these 3D printed barrels. I'm just going to glue a couple of them together and uh, put these for the Dodge. Should be work pretty good. It's got those lines and stuff on there, so it should be able to line up okay. Um, but yeah, let's get these ground down and we'll see uh, if we get these glued on here. All right, looking good so far. Everything's kind of flat and sitting even on there. See, you got them ground down and got those glued on. Looks like they're going to stay pretty securely. Got the tires all glued in there. The barrels actually worked out pretty nice. Uh, yeah, I think these are going to work out pretty well. So yeah, looking so far so good. Um, let's see how this one looks. So yeah, those are going to look pretty good once we get them um, all painted up and everything. So we're going to wait for the glue and everything to finish drying and we'll get those prime black and uh, get some details and stuff going on there and then we will move on to our next step. Alright, got everything primed up with black, got some little bit of detail going on, got some hubcaps put on there so those are all good to go. Yeah, these are looking pretty nice, I'm liking this. Um, had to consult the expert for the colors again, also known as my wife. Um, she said do a blue and a red, light blue and dark red. So, of course, we're going to go with Monument. Who else? Doing the bright jade and burnt red. Um, so let's get those painted up here real quick. Alright, there we go. Got a little fire and ice going on. I'm liking it. Um, of course, always love the Monument Hobbies Pro Acrylic. Goes on real smooth and everything. So yeah, we're going to let these uh, dry and then we'll uh, get them on the uh, bases and do a little more detail work. Then we're going to figure out what kind of uh, weapons and armor we're going to stick on there. And we'll go from there. Okay. So I've got uh, some detail stuff going on, got the headlights and taillights painted up, added to the little weathering, handles and everything painted, look pretty good. Uh, so I picked out some weapons and accoutrements, um, monster trucks, gotta have rams, right? So got these rams going on here. Um, Liking the kind of fire and ice thing, so I'm going to take some red and some blue of these speed paints and I'm going to paint the insides of the windshield to give them those those red and blue tintings. Uh, ice over here is going to be getting a turreted heavy machine gun on top. And fire, um, it's only going to get a front mounted machine gun, uh, but I'm also going to give it some nitro because it's fire, right? I'll stick some nitro uh, stickers on there. Uh, so let's get all of the bits and pieces painted up, and then we will go from there. Alright, now that we've got these um, primed and dry brushed and everything in the silver, um, See if we can start getting these together and adding a little more detail and whatnot. Uh, 
really liking how the uh, windshields turn out. I painted the insides red and blue to match the whole fire and ice scene going on. See, I ground off the top of that because that's where the uh, turret mounted machine gun is going to go. Flatter on there. Get the rams going on. So let's uh, get these babies together. So there we have it. So got some detail work done, got the weapons and everything on there. Um, had to put some decals on there. It was looking to, like it needed, needed a little something more. So we got the ice going on here. Silver skull. Got the fire going on here with the, the flaming skull piece on there. You can check that out. Of course, had to put some nitrous uh, decals on there because you got nitrous, you want people to know you got it, right? Um, gonna do a tad bit more weathering. Um, they're monster trucks. They go through mud and everything else. So I'm gonna go with the mud effects, the splatter effects on here for these ones, just to finish them up. And then we will be calling them good. All right, and there we have it. We got ice going on here. Some mud effects. Big old ram and everything. I will post the uh, build out on here after I get done showing these, these babies off. Uh, not gonna do a uh, specific sponsor for these. Adds a little bit more room for just depending on whatever you know, wanna add on to there. But I would say these are gonna be 50 can vehicles, so adding a sponsor on there is a little more room to get some perks and whatnot. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, please hit that like button. If you want to see more content and get notified when stuff pops up, please hit that subscribe. Until next time, Gaslands NorCal, signing out.